We can't say that you know you could just churn out a good leader by sending them to a, a good business school or a good governance school, and you know voila, the leader would appear. I think it's got to go back to you know reinforcing on value system in the society. Um, where is the world heading? And of course, a few strong, good ethical leaders to also become the role model. I've uh, been a hitchhiker before, so having been on the roads, you know, for one and a half, two years, uh, and being helped by so many people, when you come back, the first thing on my mind is how can I be a useful citizen? How can I contribute back, you know, to people? My name is Penny Lo. Uh, I'm a member of Parliament from Singapore and also the founder of uh, the Social Innovation Park. So the idea really is to get people into uh, a conversation and action. So it's not just a think tank, it's a do tank. Asia is the growing part of the world. So some people call it the engine of growth of the world today. So obviously any country that is within Asia will have the great opportunity to grow along with that. Singapore, for example, is a small little country in the context of the world that is devoid of any resources underground, is to rely on what's above ground, which is our human capital. We also have to make ourselves relevant economically, at least economically, you know, to the rest of the world, so that we can then continue to bring investments into the country. At this stage of Singapore where we have reached a certain level of wealth, then we've got to think about, well, how can we now enrich our neighbours? How can we now empower all those around us? Many years ago, when uh, Myanmar you know, suffered from the uh, cyclone Nargis, uh, Singapore was one of the first to extend our helping hand. It's not just about helping, it's about understanding each other and moving together. Don't try to parachute some solutions from 10,000 miles away. Look at what is it that the community already has existingly, but perhaps they are not doing it as efficiently, or that you know they are not, uh, they, they are lacking in the resources, uh, whether it is the lack of access to finance or the lack of access to demand, lack of access to market. I think we have to think in terms of prospering thy neighbors and prospering together. And as a political leader, my role is to continue that sort of value system and to ensure again that the next generation doesn't just become a me, me, me generation, but one that understands that there is a small me, but there is a big we. Mm -hmm.